Hello everybody, welcome to Tom's Garden and today is the 2nd of July, July 2018. Uh, it's not a typical summer for us, it's, it's, um, it's a very hot summer, very, it's been in the 30s, uh, late 20s, 26 degrees, 28 degrees, 30 degrees, which is not normal for us and uh, we're getting drought conditions now because of it, so it's affecting the way things will grow, so we'll just have a look around the garden. Now here's one thing that um, I find very interesting are sunflowers. Here's a sunflower seed. Take out your sunflower seed and look at that. Right, you plant that. About this time of year you plant that. And very soon it won't take long for that to come. That's a young sunflower, that's about two weeks old. And then what happens to it? It grows and grows and grows and grows and grows until it comes like this one. That's a fully grown one. The edge just popped out. That will follow the sun. Wherever the sun comes out, it'll follow it round. Greenhouse. And these are those of you remember this is a gutter guy. That's the length of gutter, so the pots are fed from the bottom. So I don't have to water these plants, and they're growing just in the fine way that any other plant would grow, and I haven't watered them. And on the other side, I've got plants that are in grow bags at the bottom, and they're not as well, they're not as tall as the ones out of the grow bag, out of the grow garden. And I've got peppers here, those are those are pepper plants and this is the first time that I've ever managed to grow pepper plants they never they've never grown at all now these have grown whether I'll get peppers or not it's another thing so let's go out to the vegetable patch now now in the vegetable patch these are peas and as you can see the peas pods are formed so we're, it's only going to be a couple of weeks now before we're actually getting sweet peas out of those and, and th those will be eaten almost immediately. None of those will get cooked, they, 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 they'll be eaten as they are. Now the flowers are suffering because of the drought conditions. They have lasted not as long as you would normally expect. Now these flowers here, they're in the irrigation system so it's not affecting them at all. Although um, they've asked us now not to use as much water so I'm going to follow the rules and regulations I always do so that these plants might suffer in weeks of home but that that's the garden for you well there's the old push iron Luke we've been out to ride on that this morning So there you have it ladies and gentlemen, that's Tom's Garden, 2nd of July 2018. Uh, I think it's only going to get worse if the drought continues. Uh, but let's not give up. You never know, it's England isn't it? It can change like that. But anyway, we'll see you all later. 